Hey guys, welcome back to another video. For today, it's going to be an unboxing video, pretty laid back. I'm gonna do an unboxing of everything that I received in the mail while I was on vacation, and then I might throw in a small little vlog at the end. Um, but you guys do know that I went to Miami for four days, so please bear with me. I am so sorry if I'm not posting as I usually do or if I'm not being as active as I am, but I'm trying to get everything organized, get everything situated, try to come up with video ideas, ideas so just bear with me please again I'm so sorry but for today like I said it's gonna be an unboxing pretty much just a laid-back video so let's go ahead and get started Whatever. All right, we're gonna go ahead and get started with Shein. Now this clothes, I was supposed to get it for my trip to Miami, and unfortunately it didn't get here on time. It arrived on Friday, and by Thursday I was already in Miami, so that was very sad, but still I'm gonna show you guys the clothing. This is one of the pieces. It's a bodysuit. It's literally all red. It's kind of like scrunched up from here and literally all throughout the bodysuit. I really like it. I feel like with my tan, it looks really pretty the color. <laughs> my tan is actually quite horrible. I wear so many different types of shirts i literally had stripes here stripes back here from this like my tan it was so bad but this is one of the pieces i actually really like it now we're gonna move on to i guess the package that's already open which are these then i got this top which is just very basic i just like very basic pieces because i can dress them up dress them down and it's this um i wouldn't say it's white it's kind of more like an ivory like an off-white color and it is crop top i really like it the material is actually not bad this would have been perfect for miami because oh my god dios mio estaba tan caliente like it was so humid in miami you guys have no idea oh this is the one that i was so excited for if you guys like any of the pieces that i show you they're gonna be linked down below i actually really like how shein stepped up like their packaging wise like now it comes even in like ziploc bags and now it says like their logo in the bag i'm like yeah shein i see you this is the two piece that i was hella excited for look at this okay it's a two piece this is like a super crop top like up to here so cute and then it comes with this which are the sweats oh my god and then on this side it has the same detail as the shirt and then they're like cinched from here from down from the ankle but oh, i cannot wait to wear this two piece i feel like it's gonna look so cute i also order like all this clothing because i want to start posting more otds on instagram oh this is the dress that looks so cute, it's cute, cute. look at this I was like, oh my god, this is going to be so pretty. Ah, oh, I love it. It's all the way down. I can see it's going to be very see-through, though. Kind of, mm, kind of, not really. It's not going to be that see-through. Yeah, definitely not that see-through. But, oh my god, this is going to look so cute. It's, like, very cinched. Like, it's kind of like a body contrast. It's very fitted to your body. And it has buttons all the way down. Let me get it up close so you guys can see. I got a pair of shorts. I had previously already ordered these shorts, but they were way too small for me. And I love them so much that I was like, you know what? This time I'm going to get them on a medium. So let me show you. So this is the medium. I previously ordered them in small and they didn't fit. So I'm so excited I got these in a medium. These are definitely going to fit. The denim feels so good. Like the material feels really, really nice, which is why when they didn't fit, I was like genuinely like for real, for real, I was so sad. So I picked these up. <laughs> So I picked these up in a medium. Okay, if you watch all of my videos, you probably noticed that I already have these in black, which are these right here. I have them in black, but I really wanted them in like a tan color. And they have black, white, and red on the side. And actually, I got these on a small because I did get medium last time. And they were a little too big. That's like the only thing about Shein when it comes to sizing. It can be a little bit weird. But I picked these up and I cannot wait to wear these. And they're so comfortable i'm like yes okay so this is a denim jacket and i've seen a lot of people wear like denim jackets even like just use them kind of like as like a cover-up so when i saw this denim jacket i was like oh my god i so need this denim jacket and it's so dope like it has this on the side oh, let me put it on and this one was in a size medium like see oh, it's like super cute or like even for like pics for like insta it can be like this 
Oh my god, I'm so in love with this. I feel like whenever you have like a date nights or whenever it's kind of like a chilly night, you can actually wear this. But I've seen so many people wear these like little denim jackets. I really wanted one and I think it's going to be super cute for like pics and stuff. I'm so excited for this. I'm so excited for everything. I'm just so sad it didn't come for my trip. I would have taken some bomb pics, girl, but it's okay. Everything happens for a reason. Oh, and I also got not a waist trainer, but I believe they're called like body shapers and I'm actually wearing it right now, but it's so good. Like it's better than the one that I got last time. So I'm going to leave that one linked down below as well. Body shapers are more like whenever you're wearing like a tight dress and you want everything to just look like snatched. <laughs> Then you wear those and everything looks really good, but I'm gonna leave everything that I showed you linked down below Okay, now this is from let me hide my address. This is from shop hush. So I am so excited This is the coat. It says coat right here. Oh, there's two palettes Whoa The first palettes of the cult series mystic and mythos That's what it looks like. Look at the packaging is so cool. I like it. It's like sleek black. It's just bad habit Let's start off with Mystics. Oh, let's see. There you go. Oh my god, we have to swatch a couple. We have to. Let's swatch Karma. Honey. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Oh my god. Just with one, I already know. Transcended. I just me don't know. This is like gorgeous. Look at those. These are beautiful. Oh my god, I so love these. Dude, I'm gonna play with these. Definitely. I'm so going to be playing with these. They look so good. And then this one is Mythos. Let's see. Okay. A ver, vamos a ver. Mytho. Oh, no. Yeah. Me muero. Oh my god. These are so gorgeous. Wow. Wow. Okay, let me do Dion, Demeter, oh my god, I'm speechless, Iris. Wow, look at that. Look at those colors. Oh my god. I am so loving these palettes. Girl. Are these even out yet? I think they're most definitely out. So, oh my god, I am so going to play with those and post pictures on Instagram. Okay, next items are also cosmetics, and these are from Subo Beauty. And Subo Beauty was so nice enough to send me this. I actually have no idea what this is. Oh, look at the packaging. Oh my god, it's so cute. It's like holographic. Oh my god, okay, let's see. What is there in here? Thank you for choosing. Have fun with these new goodies. Hope you love them. I love you. Oh, thank you so much, Olivia. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Let's see. I like the packaging though. It's really cool. I really like that. This is the Block Party palette. The colors are so vibrant and pretty. I like them. So this is the palette. And then it comes with three little, it seems like three little pots. These are body art, grape soda, tracksuit, and Crazy, which I'm guessing these are kind of like these. I thought these were the little pods, but this is actually the palette. These right here are the ones that she sent me, which is tracksuit, grape soda, and freezy, which are these right here. But you guys know that I'm trying to create new looks that are very colorful and not just so much like very natural. So I'm excited to play with those. And then I got this package that I just had to share with you guys. So one of the pita chips sent me this package, and her name is Rihanna. And Rihanna was so sweet enough to send me this. Uh, she actually sent me a letter, which I already read. So thank you so much for the letter. It was so sweet of you. And she sent me this little picture of myself, which is this make my pita. That's me. Hello. <laughs> and then she sent me a couple other goodies. She sent me these little donut notes, which I am so happy and so excited to put on my desk. So you guys know that I am very, like, I am the most disorganized person you will ever meet i'm such a hot mess i procrastinate so much so anything that keep me organized so thank you so much for sending me this so i got these little donuts and then she sent me this one which i fell in love with this it says be happy be bright be you this is basically just a notebook and it has like the marble effect with gold letters so thank you so much for this and last but not least she sent me this real techniques this is a four tool set 
from Real Techniques, the pink edition. So thank you. So I received this. And then look what I got. So me and Jason, uh, we flew to Miami on Thursday. So Thursday by around 1 p.m. We were already in Miami and we headed back home on Sunday around 1 p.m. So we decided to go walk and we found out that every Sunday they have like a farmer's market around the hotel where we stayed. So we decided to go walk around and guess what I found? <laughs> I had been looking for this for a long time, but it is ridiculously expensive. So, ta-da, it's a honeycomb. <laughs> You guys are probably like, uh, you're excited for that? I am hella excited for this. This is the Florida's Gold Honeycomb, and this one was just $20. Literally $20. I asked her, and I was like, ¿Cuánto cuesta? Like, how much is it? And she was like, $20. And I was like, oh my god. I literally looked at Jason, and I'm like, take it, take it. I want one. I've been wanting to do kind of like an ASMR and try it. I really love ASMR videos. I feel like there's something just that relaxes me. I find them so satisfying. And a lot of you guys always comment like, oh my god, when I do steals and deals especially, a lot of you guys are always like, oh my god, your voice gives me like ASMR vibes. So I've been wanting to try it out and I am so excited to try this out. I think I'm definitely going to do it in ASMR. I was thinking more of like a taste test video, but I definitely want to do, I want to do like one of those videos where you title it like, I tried ASMR and I really want to test it out. Oh my god, I'm just, I'm so excited. Like this is what it looks like. But now that's all that I received in the mail while I was out on my trip. Like I said, I'm so sorry if my videos are not like very well organized or if not, they're not like the most like creative videos, but I'm starting to sit down and plan for the whole next week. So for next week, girl, I got you. I'll be back on track. But I know a lot of you guys wanted me to film in Miami, but I feel like sometimes it's nice to just spend time without the camera and worrying about the angles or maybe i should vlog this or maybe i should vlog that especially because we went because it was jason's birthday so i decided to just relax and most of the time honestly i forgot the camera oh my god i did not tell you <laughs> girl let me get comfy and tell you so the one day that I wanted to vlog, I decided not to vlog because I was like, no, you know what? We're going to relax. We're just going to go on the bikes on, you know, South Beach. And we're going to cruise around and whatnot. Me and Jason went to a bar and we went to a bar and we started having some drinks, you know, and then I was like, you know what? Like, let's just go to the hotel. Let's go back to the hotel. We can get something to eat on the way there and then we can go to the pool. So as we are walking back to the hotel, there is the Versace Mansion, the very popular Versace Mansion. <laughs> I can't talk. The very popular Versace Mansion that's like in the very corner. So we see a whole bunch of people gather there and I'm just like, whoa, there's so much people. So we go to there. We're like, we know, the, you know, the chismosos ahí vamos. And we're like, hey, why is there so many people? They're like, it's Kim Kardashian and Kanye West inside of the mansion. And I'm like, oh, I'm shook it. And I'm like, oh my God, she's here? What the heck? So I get so excited and both of our phones are dead. And I left the vlogging camera in the hotel because I decided that I didn't want to film. I was like, you know what? We're just going to relax, have a good time, no vlogging. And I was so mad at myself. I was like, oh my God. And everyone recognized her because of the, what are those cars called? The Mercedes, the G-Wagon, that one. She had posted on Instagram, my baby for the week or for the day, something like that. And it was like a neon green G-Wagon. So everyone recognized her because of that. And the night prior to that, that G-Wagon had passed right next to us and jason was like hey that looks like a car that i've seen before some other youtuber i think his name is like popcorn or something and i was like yeah right they're not gonna be here turns out that was cam the night before that was cruising around south beach and then <laughs> jason decides he's like you know what i don't think she's gonna come out anytime soon let's run to the hotel get the camera and then come back so i'm like okay let's go i had the greatest view of where she was gonna come out and we decided to leave we literally walk like within like one block and we hear everyone going crazy and I told Jason, I'm like, I told you, let's go. So we start running back and I didn't get to see her. I only got to see Kanye West and Jason ran around the street and he got to see her like from the front windshield of the car. He literally got to see both of them and <laughs> Jason was so shocked. He was like, oh my God, babe, like she literally looks exactly like she does in her pictures. Like, wow, I'm amazed. <laughs> 
I only got to see Kanye and everyone was going crazy because it was two chains wedding right there So that was actually quite something that we are always gonna remember from our trip But I was so mad that it was like no I could have vlogged it for you guys, but yeah, that was something that I just wanted to share with you guys But I was gonna vlog like I said, but I feel like sometimes it's just nice to relax and just enjoy the trip and you know, it could be nice to like vlog it to keep memories, but sometimes it's a little bit better just to keep those memories in my heart. I'm always going to take them with me, so that's why I really didn't vlog. I hope you guys don't mind. I did vlog like a little bit. It's probably like two to three minutes if I put everything together. So I will insert that right now so you guys can see it. Okay, I look a little rough. It was literally my first time on the plane and I was hella nervous. I didn't vlog like when I was getting on. I was going to vlog like my experience. I also can't hear very well. <laughs> For some reason, I was gonna vlog my experience, but I was just so nervous I couldn't. I told Jason, I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna start the vlog like whenever we land because <laughs> I was just so nervous. And then we experienced some turbulence. Girl, I thought I was gonna die. I was like, oh my god. <laughs> now we just got here to Miami to the airport. We're trying to find our bag, and oh my god, guys. This airport is so humongous compared to the one in Austin, so we're currently looking for our bags, but once we find it, I'll keep you guys posted. All right, after like literally 30 minutes of going around the whole airport, we finally found our luggage. Now we have to get an Uber from here, and I don't know why, in the plane it was so cold, so I'm wearing like a long sleeve, like a two-piece. Girl, it's so humid, I'm gonna take this off right now. Okay, so we're in the room now. I'm gonna give you guys a little tour. This little hotel is so big. I said little, it's pretty big. Hold on, how do I turn it on? Wait, I'm confused. Oh, okay, so this is the door where you come in. There's a little mirror, hey, and then there's a little hallway here. And then <laughs> this is the closet with like a little fridge and stuff. And then here's a full size mirror. And then Dude, what is this? <laughs> Wait, hold on, I'm getting there. And then this is the toilet. Okay, this is the restroom. And then here's the sink. Oh, I really like it, babe. It's so nice. And then watch. Bam! The shower's in the middle of the room. Dude. Baby, I'm gonna see your nice little cheeks when you oh. shower. <laughs> but the shower's actually really nice, huh? No, that is weird. I have never seen anything. Yeah, me like either. This. I have never seen anything like this. Like, there's literally nothing. Like you can <laughs> see everything in the, the middle. middle. There's this little desk, I really like the lamp. And then this is the bed. And then we have the TV here in the corner and then we have a little balcony with the view of the pool. And I honestly love it, babe. What do you rate it? This is nice. I really like it. And then what's the I view here? <laughs> Jason's hella worried about when he showers. Dude, you're gonna get and the full view. A full, literally, full view. I'm just kidding. <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna get situated and we will be back. We're gonna go find a place to eat. Look how cute this elevator is. The, the marble floor. I think we're gonna go get either pizza or noodles. Are you excited, babe? Yeah. So excited to be here. I love it so far. I'm so amazed. I had never seen something so pretty like this. <laughs> I'm so excited to be here. I love it so far. Esperan en la oficina, el van está siendo dejadas. Recuerden que esto hace recogidas, en inglés se llama hop off, hop off. Recogen y sueltan.
so that's all that i recorded but it was so much fun i had never traveled anywhere like never the only place where i have ever traveled is mexico and like san antonio houston and dallas but that's about it i had never traveled anywhere else so when i got to miami i literally fell in love with it and i was like oh my god i am so coming back in december so if God provides us, um, we will go back in December with Liam, take him to Disney, and then we will take him to Miami to the beach. But yeah, um, I think that's it for this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Like I said, it was just pretty much like a laid back video. Um, yeah, I think that's it. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. I love you guys so, 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 so much. And I will see you guys on the next one. Bye, guys. Make sure you're subscribed so you can watch all of my videos and if you want to keep on watching more and more videos, make sure to check out yesterday's video. You are not going to want to miss it. It's amazing. Also, if you want to get to know me a little bit better, make sure to subscribe to that vlogging channel right there. And if you can't get enough of me, here is my Spanish channel so you can go ahead and subscribe. Love you guys so much and I'll see you tomorrow.